everyone hope you guys are doing good this is Sai from data ants today we'll be going over uh, how to use SuiteQL to make better um, data extraction from NetSuite in order for you to like do your analysis in like tools like Power BI Tableau or any BI solution of your choice not just for that if you're looking for data migration from NetSuite to another ERP too SuiteQL could be a good tool now that um, NetSuite has its own data warehousing platform, NSAW, NetSuite Analytics Warehouse, you can use SuiteQL to basically retrieve the data you want from NetSuite and do your own reports, dashboards, or build your own data sets inside the uh, NSAW instance. So this is like um, a suite led developed by Tim Dietrich that I was able to install in my instance or demo instance here. So this is basically where I would query anything that I want to like quickly check and see if it's working before I actually use it in my tool of choice. So I, I built a, a detailed course, um, Introduction to SuiteQL for people who are interested to retrieve the different aspects of um, the data from NetSuite, be it through ODBC. You can either pay for like the ODBC driver connection, like it's called Suite Analytics Connect. NetSuite charges you like a one-time sorry, a monthly fee. Um, and then that's uh, that allows you to connect uh, to Power BI, Tableau, or in any database solution to, through the ODBC drivers. You can have 32-bit drivers or 64-bit. So that's one way of connecting. Um, the other route is through the REST API, where you could use post, like a solution like Postman to basically connect, um, like using token-based authentication to connect to uh, the NetSuite database and use Suite Q QL queries to pull out the data. Obviously, there are other uh, approaches you could you could do other operations like import, uh, like sorry, uh, update, delete, um, insert as well. But the, most of them like work through regular operations through the REST web services. Um, so these are the two native approaches that are like I guess one is paid and one is free. But either way, SuiteQL is a very powerful tool which basically makes your NetSuite database uh, work through SQL. So SuiteQL is nothing but like a, a query language which is on the back end of NetSuite. So there are certain um, table references in the SuiteLet that will be useful for you to like go over. So say for me, the most important table would be the transaction table. So if I were to like search for transaction, this uh, table reference would give me this and shows me what all joints that I can connect to and how these joints are the cardinality is uh, My custom records that I'm connected to so on and so forth So the other way of looking into the records catalog I would say is going to set up and records catalog This would give you the list of all the tables in your system um, That you can access to not just the records you can also type in and search for the fields as well so if you know the internal ID of the field that you're looking for, you can just simply search for it here. So this would al allow you to even replicate save searches that are built in the system and use SuiteQL to build those in a, in a query format. And you can do select uh, the list of the field names from so-and-so, you can do the joins uh, based on this. So I can give you a quick example, like let's search for account, right? So if I were to select account and then Suite Script and REST Query API, can see that it shows you all of the list of fields available here and how these are joined with the different tables in the system, right? So th this again varies across, uh, varies from your instance to mine, from my demo account to yours. So um, so best way to like do is through start off from your transaction table. Say for example, you wanted to fill out like a cash sale record. So this is how you would do it. So this is how you would get started with um, using your SuiteQL uh, analysis. So for the detailed um, SuiteQL approach, I've like built a small course and it's available on the link in the description. So feel free to check it out. Um, and yeah, do subscribe for more useful NetSuite content. Thank you guys.